Hi, I'm Tom Mullaney, Google Certified Innovator and Digital Learning Coach at Gravely Hill Middle School in Eflin, North Carolina. What makes me googly? I guess it's that I live in beta. I'm always revising the things I create. For instance, my blog posts, my digital breakout EDU games. If you haven't tried those, please do. They're really fun and educational. And my screencasts on my YouTube channel. I'm always going in and making new ones as Google updates its products. Have a look at one now. This screencast is about the awesome Google Expeditions app, an app that will take your kids places they can't go, and in some cases, no human can go. I'll back that up in a minute. To lead an expedition with your own phone, use your mobile hotspot, make sure you are not connected to Wi-Fi and that you are connected to 4G. Turn it on. The devices students use to view the expedition will connect to this hotspot through their Wi-Fi. So now my hotspot is on, bring up expeditions. Notice the heart. They have systems of the body, places no human can see with the naked eye. I'm from New York. It's where I started my career in education. So if you think we're not exploring the New York Transit Museum, forget about it. So I want to tap the expedition. Tap start. Notice it says no explorers found. Off to the side, I'll connect the iPad to my phone's wireless hotspot and join the expedition. Notice the no explorers message has gone away. Expeditions give students a 360 view of the scene. There are multiple scenes in each expedition. As you see there. Let's start with turnstiles. Let's look at the narration content. There are different levels of questions so you can differentiate your narration from group to group. Notice the full 360 ceiling to floor view. I suggest having students participate in expeditions in swivel chairs. It's the best way to comfortably view the scene. See the smiley face? That is where my iPad is looking in student view. Teachers see a smiley face wherever a student is looking. If I want to direct my students to look at a certain spot, such as bringing back the city sign, I'll tap and hold. Students then see this target. If they're looking away from the spot, they see the arrow. To end the expedition, I tap pause button. It's that simple. What a great app for opening the world to your students.